uh, hello friends welcome to this video so in this video I will show you a module inside Vue.js 3 which is able to create this complex flowcharts diagrams inside your application so if you want to create these flowcharts connecting with one other with nice little animation arrows you can use a module inside uh, Vue.js if you go to npmjs.com uh, just search for this package which is at the rate view-flow so this is essentially this package just wait let me open the zoom it tool so simply search this I have already installed it so the command is very simple uh, you I've already installed it and it's almost having 50,000 weekly downloads so they do offer a official website viewflow-dev so they have a nice documentation as well so now to integrate this inside your Vue.js application uh, so just you need to edit your app.view file this is your file here app.view so just open that and uh, first of all we need to register this module so we'll just write uh, the TypeScript code so we'll just import this and then import this module view flow and then we need to create the reference or the notes so it will be an array of objects so each object will represent the actual item in the flowchart so you can give it an ID type here will be of input and then you can provide a position as well so this will be containing the X coordinate and the Y coordinate so X will be 250 Y is 5 so this represents the position on the page so where it displays and then whatever data that you want to display in this node so let me label this as this is node 1 in, and then you can even customize it by providing the style object which contains the CSS properties what background color color that you want to give right here so you will def give it like this so after this after you declare everything these edges now we need to declare the edges variable so this will represent the the relationship between these edges so you have declared all these edges right here so this nodes variable let me paste all this so in this way you would declare more nodes so this is id1 this is id2 and this is id3 so now we have three nodes and now in the edges how they are related the relationship so right here you will give it an ID here so E1 is related to E2 so in this way you mention it so whatever so like this so here the second property is the source and then the target so here you provide the IDs so that's why we give these unique IDs to it so we are just targeting these elements just putting this relationship and then you can provide a, again a style sheet as well styles object so in this way you can mention their relationship so you can see 1 is related to 2 and then 2 is related to 3 you can even put animated to true as well so it will have this nice little animation as well so now we come to the template where you need to show these flowchart and diagrams and you give it a CSS class or flow container and then we simply render this component and it actually takes two parameters first of all the nodes which is contained inside nodes and the edges so their relationship here how they are related so if you just refresh your browser you will see this nice little flowchart diagram you can uh, drag and drop with your mouse as well so now to actually include the CSS we do need to include the base CSS of this package so 
inside the style tag we just need to import the view flow core package slash dist style dot css so as soon as you do this we also need i have attached full source code in the description of this video so as soon as you paste it you will see it will be now be related you can move it anywhere in the page by your mouse so, so in this way you can use this package to create flowchart and diagrams so thank you very much for watching this video and uh, do check out my website as well uh, freemediatools.com uh, which contains uh, thousands of tools regarding audio video and image and I will be seeing you guys in the next video.